Okay, YouTube uh, YouTube friend Asalaam Alaikum wants me to show him what uh, drain is like in the southern hemisphere and whether the uh, water flows anti-clockwise when you drain it out. So I'm here in the shed and this is a, a image of a, a product just to show you that it's not backwards. And let's see, let's drain some water out now and see how it looks. And see how gently without stirring the water. See if it goes anti-clockwise. Oops, let's have a look. What direction is it going? It seems to be going sort of straight down, doesn't it? That old basin. Well, it's only a camping dish. Perhaps you've got to get lots of water. What am I? I'm in about the same parallel, not parallel, what is it? On the same latitude as of Sydney, about really. That wasn't a very good experiment. I'll have to try and repeat it to show if it goes anti-clockwise or not. Let's see without disturbing the water too much. Without the fan. Well, the water's pretty still. There it goes again. Where it was going. I thought it was going clockwise. <laughs> I don't know what way it's going. Should I get a piece of, should I get a pin or a matchstick and float on the water? Let's see what happens this time. I don't know if this experiment is methodologically flawed or not. It might be. It might even depend on whereabouts in the basin the plug is. Anyway, here goes. Would it depend how close one is to the equator and how still the water already is and the position of the uh, plug and everything? Let's see anyway what happens this time. I could even, yes, you can. I know you can dictate the way it swirls by deliberately winding it around. Any Every child knows that, don't they? You can dictate the way it swirls by swirling it on purpose. But anyway, let's let it out and see what happens this time and see if we can catch some waves. what way that is turning. I'm in the shed. I suppose I should go over to the house and conduct further experiments in the bathtub. Okay, this time the basin's got about three buckets of water in it. I'll just do this now. Well, you know, does the current make a difference? Does the amount of water in it make a difference too to the experiment? Anyway, let's see if the weight of the water makes a difference to the experiment. Was that clockwise or anti-clockwise? Probably clockwise or something. I can't see properly in this screen. Okay, this is a laundry sink now. Let's see what happens here. I'll just unplug it, see how it goes.
Well, that looked sort of that looked sort of clockwise to me, anyway. I'm no expert. I'm no physicist. I'm not. <laughs> 